am Bikashi Star, and welcome back to my channel. Today we are playing a brand new game. Today we are playing Carpe Diem, and I downloaded this game from Steam.com. I don't think it's .com. I don't know what it is, but I downloaded it from Steam. If you're a gamer, then you should know that Steam is another um, gaming company that just provides or supplies downloadable games. Um, so I just I actually just got a Steam account. If you want to add me on Steam, my username is because she's star. I actually just bought another brand new game. That was the reason why I got Steam was because I wanted to say I wanted to play City Skylines, and so I, I downloaded that game for Christmas because it was on sale. And then I saw this fun, pretty little game to play as well. And this is actually a free download from Steam. Um, and so I thought I would check it out and see how it works. Now this is, I don't know the technical term for this type of game. It's a game where it gives you, it's a story game. So there's a backstory to the game and you read like what's happening in the story and then you like have to make decisions and go throughout the day. And so this particular day, uh, particular game is you're playing as this little girl. I don't remember her name, but we'll find out here in a second. And she basically only has one day to live. And so it's about Carpe Diem, uh, seizing the day and you live out her final day. Um, on earth it's a little morbid uh, I don't know why she only has one day but she only has one day hopefully we'll figure that out why and uh, we'll see how this game works I have never played a game like this before but I have seen them played out quite a bit I've watched actually I've watched a lot of let's plays like games like this so hopefully it will turn out good let me stop rambling and hit start <laughs> Jing she's late I've experienced some problems lately and we weren't able to hang out in a while I managed to get things working so I can spend time with her, but it is only temporary and I don't know how long it will last. I- Hey! Hey, Jing! Sorry, did I keep you waiting? Yeah, for about a half an hour. A guy's supposed to say not at all here, you know? I don't- I didn't know that. Oh wait, are we a guy? I'm so confused, I thought we were a girl. I'm confused. Uh, Jung! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know that. I wasn't notified about this change in, soci in society. They didn't bother because they know you're not going to follow it anyway. Jing, dang it. Ah, so where do you want to go? Do we want to go to the mall, the park, or the arcade? I kind of want to go... Where should we go? <sighs> I kind of want to go, let's go, let's go, let's go to the mall. Let's go to the mall. How about the mall? Wow, didn't expect you to su suggest going to the mall. Jing, why is that? Because you get bored easily when you're, you're when you're shopping with me. Yeah, but this time I have stuff I want to buy. Hmm, I wonder what it is. Duct tape to shut you up. <laughs> that was a good put down. I like that one. Oh my, when did you become so kinky but whatever you're into but whatever you're into i guess you know you like it she laughs as she pulls me toward the mall it takes a lot of time energy and money to shop with i normally i would avoid the shopping mall like a plague but i'll make today an exception wow they're having a big sale we just stepped into the shopping mall's entrance and she's already pointing at a clothing store. Let's check it out. She pulls me toward the store, then proceeds to keenly examine every part of every clothing, like a detective looking for evidence. She picks up a white dress with flower designs on the bottom half. One sec, she heads to the fitting room to try it on. How does this look? You look the same. It's hard for me to answer this question because I have zero sense of fashion. I'm the type of guy who would wear anything that fits my size. So whenever she asks me this question, I relay on the magic word, cute. I think it's cute. She looks at a mirror. Really, isn't it a bit, a bit plain? I touch my chin with my right hand as if to reanalyze the clothing. I find it cute. I'll take it. 
She goes inside the fitting room to take it off. She then walks to the cashier to pay for it. Is that all you need from this store? Pretty much. They don't have much on anyway. Then we continue to walk around the mall. She's like a chunk of steel while stores are strong magnets. magnets. Whenever we are walking, she slowly strays toward a store sometimes without her even knowing it. Hey, Jing. Jung? Jing. I don't know how to say this name. But <laughs> this looks good on you. She holds up a shirt with a spider print. I don't really need new clothes. I'll buy it for you. I'm not wearing that. She picks another shirt up. There. I'll buy myself one as well so we all match. I'll wear it with you. That's not the problem. I know it's no use when she makes up her mind. While she's paying for the shirts, my eyes wander around and see a computer store. Let's head there when you're done. I point to it with my thumb. Oh yeah, you did say you needed to buy something. Yeah, I'm going to see if they have cheap parts there. Especially hard drives. The program I'm developing is bigger than I expected. She silently follows me into and around the computer store. Just a few seconds and I'm ready to pay for my items. That was fast. That's how you're supposed to shop. Nah, you're not even checking if they work or not before you buy them. That's what warranties are for. I go to the cashier and pay. Where do you want to go next? I saw a toy store over there. Let's check it out. That's definitely my type of store. We enter the toy store and I immediately heads to the plush area. I would too. Look at all these cuties. I want all of them. Go for it, as long as you have money. What? I thought you're paying. Keep dreaming. I am kidding. But seriously, though, they're, they're so cute. I wonder what I should get. While well, she's busy picking a plushie, I head to the next aisle where the keychains are. I saw a spider keychain. Ah, she would love this. I quickly go to the cashier to pay for it, then walk back to I who still can't decide what to get. I totally like that when it comes to plushies or dolls. Hey, I, I bought this for you. I show her the keychain. That's so cute. You didn't have to. It's fine. I wasn't that, it wasn't that expensive anyways. Man, we're jerks. She looks really happy about the cheap keychain I got her. While walking, I sees a bookstore. Hey, let's stop here for a bit. I didn't know you like reading books. Well, not those kinds of books. I'm actually starting to get into cooking, so I see you're looking for cookbooks. Yeah. What kind of dishes do you like? I'll try to cook for you sometime. What? Beef bo... I know what this is. I just can't say it. Beef bourguignon? There we go. Wow, chill. Why didn't we start with bacon and eggs? Why even bother asking, men? She smiles as she takes three beginner cookbooks from the shelf. I'm starting to get hungry. Oh yeah, I just realized I'm kind of hungry now too. We head to the mall's food court. What do you want? Whatever you're getting, I'll just share with you. Alright, find us a spot and I'll buy food. I go to buy a large serving of maki rolls and sushi. This is probably enough for four people. Whatever, I like these anyway. That's kind of a lot, don't you think? I'm going to have you eat all, all of these. I want you big. No way, I'm going to eat all of that. I'm kidding. But these do look yummy. I might eat more than I intend to. I, real, I realize how hungry I am when I finish the whole serving within five minutes. Wow, you were that hungry. Apparently. I sit back and let my stomach bloat. Where do you want to go next? Let's see. How about the arcade? All right. As we walk inside the arcade, her eyes are filled with amazement and excitement. Hey, J Jing? We're gonna call him Jing or Jung. We're gonna call him How about June? We're just gonna call him June. We're gonna call ourselves June. Hey, June, look! She points at a crane game. I'm really bad at those. I has always loved cute things. I want that big spider plushie. And she finds spiders extremely cute for some reason. I try to reach for a coin in my pocket. Wait, let me do it. I want to get it on my own. She pulls out some coins and starts playing. The plushie has all her attention. Her first try barely catches the thing she wants. What were you even trying to get? Hush, let me concentrate here. 
She manages to grab it, but still no luck. Ah, it fell! She inserts another coin and tries again. And again. And again. This crane is broken! Of course it's not. Here, let me get it for you. I'm good at crane games myself, but I've got to show off somewhere. Somehow. Got it! Thank goodness. Wow, how did you do that? Easy. I prayed to all gods I know of. Of course I can't say that. It's all in the timing. It was a fluke, right? Of course n I immediately stop when I see her holding out a coin. I will just keep quiet before she asks me to do it again. I hand her the big plushie and she hugs it tight. There are some racing games over there. Want to try it? Not very fond of those. I'll watch you. I'll just watch you. Okay, I will just play a couple of rounds. I'm not a I'm not a big fan of racing games either. I just like their setup in the arcade. We are almost completely enclosed and the seat tilts according to the game. It feels real. I stands behind me and watches me watches as I play. As expected, I lost the first round horribly. Wow, June, are you even trying? Bystanders don't get to talk. She plays with her plushie as I continue my game. Then again, I lost. Ah! Just as I thought, this isn't really my thing. If only they had this kind of setup for a completely different game. I chuckles as if to mock me. I think you'd suck at whatever game it is. Is that why you can never win against me? Oh yeah? Why don't we settle this once and for all? She points at the fighting game arcades. I loved playing these when I was a kid, so prepare to get your butt kicked. I accept your challenge, your challenge, missy. Finally, a game I can play with her. It's not really a date if I'm the only one having fun, right? Practice game, I don't know the buttons yet. I also have not played this in a long time. We sit across each other and her voice is all I can hear. Spend the first round trying to figure out what every button does. After trying some combinations, my character accidentally hit hers. No fair, don't hit me yet. Hurry up, I can't wait anymore. Just one sec, how do I... Oh, never mind. Alright, I got it. Come, come at me anytime, bro. The battle begins and we get so into it that I forget how many rounds we did. But we are more or less evenly matched. I win half the time and she wins the other half. More importantly, I get to see a side of her I rarely see. Why did I do that? Strangely, strangely enough, it's the side of her I find the cutest. The buttons are not listening to me. It's totally me when I'm playing. Oh my goodness. I only see her like this when I play with her at home, which only happened once or twice before. Ha! I won! Beat that! I'm just trying to keep my laughter in while listening to her. We play one round after another. Hey! No fair! It, I wasn't ready! The more she plays, the better she gets. See, I've beaten you three consecutive times already. Who says the word consecutive? Really now? Screw this. She laughs and stands up to stretch. She sees the poster on the wall about a firework display happening tonight. Hey! She looks at me, pointing at the poster. Poster? I know, I see it. Can we go? Sure, I also know a spot around there perfect for watching it. Really? Yeah, they do this show every year. Awesome! I'm excited! It takes a bit of walking to get there, plus to go up the hill. The sun just set when we arrived, so it was starting to get dark. Ooh, this is really pretty. Good! It's just us here. Wow, you're right! This is a good view. Right? We sit on the bench and wait for the show. Not long after, dots of light shoot toward the sky, slowly fade and bloom like flowers of different colors. The cheers of the crowd at the foot of the mountain can be heard. Ai's face is filled with happiness just watching the fireworks. I wish this, this could last forever, but I'm running out of time. She looks at me with a sad look. It's time, isn't it? Almost. Don't worry, it won't be long. It's fine. 
You really shouldn't bother hanging out with me. Don't say that. After all, I'm just... What in the world? Have you heard of the Turing test? It's an evaluation of a machine's ability to exhibit intelligence. Whether it can act or speak like a human, but however good a machine becomes, however indis indistinguishable it is from humans, it will never be an actual human being. Just like I. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Just like I, no matter how good her program is, and no matter how much I deny it myself, she will never be real. We aren't in the same dimension and reality. She will continue to dwell inside the artificial world that I created. Ugh. The program crashed again. As expected, I it couldn't go on any longer than that. I really need to come up with a stable fix soon. What am I doing with my life? I ask that question every day. Thank you for reading. <laughs> that was very interesting. I did not expect that to happen. Like that was so weird. You're playing a you're playing a video you're playing a video game that's playing a video game. I mean that is that was interesting. That did not go how I was expecting at all. That was, um, that was very interesting. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed that. This was really different than what we normally do. I've never actually really played a game like that before. That was interesting. I liked that. That was fun. And then there are other, as you saw, we could have gone to the mall or the park or the arcade. So maybe next time, if we play this again, if you guys like this, um, uh, maybe we can play the park again pay, play the park one because we already went to the mall and i'm assuming that the arcade would be the same thing as the arcade we went to in the mall so yeah thank you guys so much for watching let me know if you guys liked this game or these types of games down below in the comments i would love to hear from you guys and become besties i hope you guys are having a grand glorious day bye